Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, it's Michelle here. Um, for those of you who are new, um, this is my YouTube channel. Uh, and yeah, I, I will be posting videos every single week about all things law school. So the law school admission cycle, um, you know, the application cycle, anything you all wanna know. Um, also we'll be posting videos about, I guess like my life um, in the sense that, uh, well, we're very like academic life. Um, so I will be starting law school in August. So I'm super excited for that. Um, so be prepared for videos about, you know, what the first year of law school is like, um, I guess like what I expected versus like what I didn't expect and so on. I'm pretty nervous, um, but we'll see how it goes. But for now, um, today's video is dedicated to my uh, LSAT horror story, uh, LOL. Um, so, okay, I should reiterate, it was my LSAT writing horror story. Um, but let me share with, to you, let me share what happened. Okay, let's get to it. Um, so the LSAT writing um, is 35 minutes. It's an online exam and I was super nervous. Um, so as you all know, in my previous section video, if you don't know what the LSAT writing is, go check that out. I talk about it, I describe it, and um, y'all know what it is if you look at my other video. But anyway, um, LSAT writing. So I had to take it. Um, I was super nervous, honestly pretty drained, um, but you know, I was prepared. I told myself this was it, this is the last thing I need to do, and then I'm done, I'm good. I go and I take my exam, they did my room scan, I had to put my phone away and everything like that. I wrote my essay, everything was going well. Um, I was almost done um, and there was like a big timer on the right hand side and it said like, uh, I had like two more minutes left literally and I was honestly rereading my essay at this point, um, felt pretty good about it and um, I was about to submit my essay and it just crashed. Like my laptop, my laptop didn't crash, like the site just crashed and like it just went away. So then at this point I started freaking out because I was like, what am I supposed to do? Um, and I felt like this, this is how I felt at that moment. Um, I, yeah, it was, it was brutal. It was brutal. Uh, cue Olivia Rodrigo, honestly. Um, she didn't exist back then. Um, it was horrible. It was actually really bad. And um, I started freaking out, you know, as anyone would. And I didn't know what to do because, you know, they make you put your phone away. So then I was afraid to even take out my phone to like call the helpline because I was like, what if they think I'm cheating or whatever? Um, but at that point, I had no choice. Um, and I, yeah, so I guess you're wondering what happened. So what happened, I took out my phone, I called the LSAC um, helpline or whatever. Um, I waited 45 minutes on the phone, but you know, they answered and they were super nice about it and super helpful. They calmed me down. Um, they told me everything's gonna be okay. Um, and uh, they gave me another chance to go and retake my um, LSAT writing. So I thought that was really nice. And yeah, I wrote happily ever after because at that moment, it did not seem like a happily ever after. But, um, you know, after I got a hold of them, and they talked to me, um, they made everything okay. I went like a courageous, you know, law school applicant I am, I went and I retook the LSAT writing portion, and everything went well that time, but you could only imagine how nervous I was. Um, because it's the type of thing that it's like, everyone talks about it, like, you know, they're like, oh my God, what if your Wi-Fi cuts out or something like that? And you just hope it never happens to you. And then of course it happens to you and you're like, oh my God. But yeah, that happened. And um, it was honestly pretty scary, but uh, it went well. And I, I, did the, I did the writing and um, it was nice. It was like the first one was like a legit practice. That's how I took it. Um, so moral of the story, always view the cup half full. Um, there's a good in everything. And um, yeah, LSAC was pretty nice about it. And um, it was good. So if this happens to you, don't freak out. Just get your phone out. Found, uh, hello. Get your phone out and call the LSAC hotline, not hotline, the helpline or something, and they will help you out. Uh, you might have to wait a while. And I know that could get super frustrating. But at that point, just do it. And um, they'll restore everything and help you out. 
that was a super short video. I'm sorry, but I just had to talk about it. Like there's only so much I could say about my horror story, right? Like boom, 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 this happened and it's done. But anyway, make sure to like and subscribe um, if you are into my videos. If you're not into my videos, I, you know, I'm just out here trying to, trying to live. Um, but yeah, like and subscribe and comment below as to what kind of videos you want to see next. Uh, if you have any questions, I will always answer. Um, so leave your questions, comments below and have a great day. Um, yeah, thanks.